So we're just going to go through Cloud Hands. Um, this is a move that you find in a lot of Qigong sequences and Tai Chi forms. Um, it's done in different ways. Again, you see it in a sort of round forms, this sort of stuff. It's an evasive move, the application in the Wu Dang. Um, again, in all the different Tai Chi's, Cloud Hands. Um, again, I see it like this in a sort of Qigong, some of the Qigong styles, this sort of thing going on. Again, it's going to show a flowing, moving cloud hands. Um, generally, with a lot of the Qigong sequences, they, ha they have effects on different organs because you're massaging the organs as you're doing these sort of movements. That's the uh, thought process in a lot of these moves. And we're just going to I'm just going to show you a flowing move drill that is and an application to elbows really, elbow strikes with a bit of footwork involved. Okay, so I'm gonna come back, I'm, you know, I'm struggling for a bit of space, I might have to move around a little bit. But I'm gonna start here, so I'm gonna start off really slow, so I'm gonna go right elbow, okay. Again, so it's like an elbow strike here. Again, my left palm faces the ceiling, right palm faces up, tensions out the shoulders. If I wanna sink deeper, I can do, but I wanna start sort of high-ish at the moment. Here, here. Okay, this sort of thing going on. So again, start again. So here we go. We go right elbow, left elbow. Now again, this left elbow has ended up on top, so I'm going to step to that side with my opposite leg behind that facing left leg. I'm going to step to here. Okay, so again, we'll come this way. So you see that? So here we go. One, two. Again, I'm going to step to that left side with my right foot going behind the rooted left leg. Here, again, and carry on. Left, right. Now the right's ended up on top, so I'm gonna to step to that right with my left foot, my opposite leg, behind the rooted right leg. So here, and we go, one, two. Again, take your time. Again, left, left is ended up on top, so I'm gonna to step to that left side with my opposite right leg behind the left rooted leg. I'm going to step to here, okay, cross legs, here, here, okay, right arms ended up on top, the elbow strike there, so I'm going to go into my right with my left leg behind the rooted right leg again. So it, as you see, it can end up sort of quite flowing sequence. Here, one, two, three, just constantly flowing. So hit the side of there. One elbow, two elbow, step, push off, go again. Right elbow, left elbow, step to the left, carry on again. Maybe hitting the wall, snapping back. Again, again, quite a flowing sequence there. I'm going for it a little bit slower so you can just see where the elbow strikes come in here, here, and then you're stepping off to that side. Again, so a little bit of footwork with the elbows, a bit of coordination. So you can just sort of see a lot of Tai Chi stuff does officially have applications with it. Again, obviously more in the Wu Dang form, it's more of an evasive move, but again, or sort of like a deflection type move. But again, as you see, the elbow strikes with the footwork come in there on that cloud hands. Again, within Qigong, you're always looking at the organs, etc., stuff like that, and the massage. You're looking at the massage on the stomach and the spleen. Is there the actual organs that have been benefited from that? And that is cloud hands and the applications with the elbow strikes or the martial arts sort of applications to that and just the organs that it's replenishing as you do that you're massaging the organs as with all Qigong sequences. Lovely. Bang.